Hello and welcome to another GCSE PE related video. Today I'm going to run through a GCSE PE video that's targeted towards this year's examinations. And please, before we begin, do not forget to subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell. So, when we inhale, intercostal muscles, which are muscles that are found in between the ribs, contract. And what this does is this moves the ribs up and out, which creates a larger chest cavity. So the space within the chest becomes a lot larger. The diaphragm also contracts and it moves downwards. So again, creating more space within the lungs. As a result of this, the pressure outside of the body is greater than it is inside the body. So air is inhaled through the nose and mouth and travels from an area of high pressure to an area of low pressure in the lungs. When we exhale, our diaphragm returns to its dome-like shape. So it relaxes and moves upwards and the intercostal muscles also relax. Now this causes the ribs to move down and in. So you can imagine that all of a sudden the chest cavity decreases in terms of size. And for that reason, the atmospheric pressure inside the lungs increases, which forces the air from the lungs to the outside environment. It's also worth noting down that our lungs expand during exercise. And this is made possible by the pectorals, which are muscles found in the chest, and the sternocleidomastoid, which are muscles found in the neck. This enables us to take in more oxygen, which will help us cope with the demands of exercise. It's also worth noting that during exercise, when we exhale, the ribs are forcefully pulled downwards and this is supported by the abdominals and this is useful as it enables us to eject more carbon dioxide from the lungs. Thank you for joining me. I hope you found it helpful. Good luck in your exams this year and please, 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 if you do have any questions or concerns, please just share them in the comment section below. I am more than happy to help. Thanks for joining me. Take care. See you again soon.